guys welcome back to my channel today i have a new haul video and this is not the box i have like four different boxes and tan is playing like with one box so i just have put all the things in the sephora thing i actually filmed all this video yesterday but somehow i forgot to put my mascara that was the first thing my mic was also off so there was no such like voice recording i had to like refilm it again so today again i'm like filming all the videos anyways now going on to the haul so this is like the biggest haul i've done like since a very long time i have from different size and stuff that is why i have like so many boxes but first going on to sephora this is like a huge box but there is like just like three things first i got first. the sephora colorful blush that is what i am wearing on my face i have I was trying out for a video so i got the shade charmed i'm not sure whether this is the new one because this is available on sephora middle east but on sephora.com this one is not available the other packaging one and the colors are like different so i'm not sure this is like exclusive or what i'm not sure and this was i think for 75 dirhams all the prices will be on the uh, screen so yeah this is like a nice darker peachy orangey color which i like the shimmer one so this is giving me like a nice glow so first i got this because i haven't like tried anything from sephora collections these were like not too expensive so i thought i'll give it a try, try. then second then i got second the sephora shifter palette this is also not too expensive and i wanted to try out new palette and this was like very similar to the uh, natasha denona i think it's the nude palette or uh, glam palette the smaller one the shades were like similar to those in the shade infinite nude so this is like a nice pipe and eyeshadow palette so this is how it looks and this is also what is on my eyes you have like a nice cream color then you have like this deeper one which i've used it as my eyeliner and to uh deepen up my lower lash line and then you have like a nice shimmer shade this is like the topper shade which is all over my eyes and then you have like a nice blending color i have like all these things on my lids and this is actually so pretty not too expensive at all there are like uh, different types i think four to six different types i think i'm going more in like a different uh, color story and you have like a nice mirror here as well so i really like this the color shifter has been developed responsibly the packaging is designed without magnets its cardboard is made from responsibly managed forest it is recyclable simply by removing pans mirror if you want to recycle it you can just simply uh, remove the thing that is mentioned here so i mean that's good and it is not too expensive also which i like so maybe we'll do like a comparison video soon then lastly i got the lipstick that i'm actually wearing so this is the fenty beauty velvet liquid lipstick and i got the shade the mvp01 so this is the shade the rihanna wore to the game and it was like beautiful bright red color and she usually makes the most beautiful flattering red color that looks flattering on every skin tone and i usually buy a really good red i have to say rihanna comes out with most beautiful red colors no doubt this looks actually so good very comfortable on the lips so here we have the packaging and then you can see on the top there's like this holographic fenty beauty logo like a different packaging and then this is the color of the lipstick applicator and it is very comfortable so yeah this is like a really nice lipstick so these are the three things that i got from sephora i am gonna go accordingly then next going on to revolve uh, dot com i got just two things from their tower 28 products because tower 28 products are not available anywhere else and just on cult beauty and they don't have any new arrivals i saw it on revolve i had to pay like 39 dirham shipping if you have like a uh, I think around three four hundred maybe or five hundred get like free shipping, but I didn't want to get anything more, so I just got these two new things. First, we have the Tower Twenty Eight Beauty. This is the Juice Balm Tinted Lip Balm, and I got the shade Squeeze. And the packaging is like color coded, and this is the color of the lip balm, and this is the packaging, very pretty, like a nice chubby lip balm. So you can see it is like color coded. It's not actually like orange orange, but it is like a nice uh, vibrant uh, coral color which would be really good for summer season and it actually feels really good on my hands so i wanted something like much more orangey orangey for summer season because uh, not pink most like orange summer for summer season so i got this there is like four shades in this but i want to try out and i don't buy like a lot of uh, lipstick in like two three i don't buy like two three lipsticks at once uh, because i have like so many lipsticks so i don't need 
all the shades from all the brands from all the collection so i just buy like one max to max two if i want to but mostly okay. one then we have the so tower 28 sculptino soft contour cream and this is the contour cream and i got the shade uh jetty uh, so i think the there are like four shades in this and if uh, you have tried the tower 28 blush balm it is very similar to that and i love the formula of that and this is also what i'm wearing on my face so this is like a nice color maybe i could go like a little i mean one shade like deeper but i think uh, i'm just getting into like cream contour and cream bronzer so cream contour so i don't want to like regret using like a deeper color if i don't like blend it properly so i prefer like these kind of shades which are like easy going use it like easily i love tower, tower 28 products they are really good honestly then from beauty bay i got like uh, two or three things so from beauty bay i got these four things beauty bay arabia so i got these four things firstly i got the about face line artist longwear gel eyeliner in the shade sad girl so this is the packaging i love the blue color it is so vibrant so and it was not too expensive i think around 55 dirhams or so so i got this one I want to try like the about face products but they are like totally out of stock just like one shade is available in their eyeshadow and their glitter shadow and the their liners are like not available new lipsticks which are like the maracuja juicy lip that is also not available even on cult beauty they are not available so i don't know where to buy like the new products from there uh so yeah i got this color and not all brands like deliver out of us and that's totally fine but uh yeah let's see whenever i they are like in stock and they have like new arrivals i'll surely buy that so this is like the twist up eyeliner it doesn't look like that vibrant let's see how it works on my eyes we'll try it out soon but it's gliding easily but i wish it was like much more vibrant like the package then secondly i got the um made by Mich michelle i don't know how to pronounce his name so we have the sweet cheeks blush it is not blush it is liquid blusher so you have the blush blush i got the shade sweet cheeks which is this vibrant pink color baby doll pink color which i usually don't use i not a big fan so i thought i'll i'll see how it works because i wanted the two face blushes but they are not available yet so i thought i would try this and i they are not like too expensive it was also for a good price i want to try like the contour and stuff but they were like out of stock and i got it from beauty bay arabia so whenever they are in stock i will be collecting more so yeah slowly i will build up my collection so i like the packaging it is like so neony very pretty i love this neon packaging and this is like color coded so the color that you see on the packaging is the actual color of the blush blush so this is the packaging nice neon cover and then you have the details written here and then you have this nice applicator so this is the color it looks like much more purpley purple like on the screen but it is like much more like vibrant baby doll pink color and i'm excited to try this out then lastly i got the most expensive blush in my collection so these are the denessa myrix beauty yummy skin blurring balm powder flushed so i got two shades so you can as you have seen on social media these are like over hyped up and she has like really great products but they are like expensive i uh, i love blushes so i got two shades i want like a I maybe want maybe i'm not even sure i'll buy one which is like much more lighter shade these are like you can see the colors are like vibrant and these look very similar to the colors that i have from tower 28 beauty so maybe i'll do like a um, swatch side by side and see how it looks later on so of course i got the shade golden r and prima donnas so i got this beautiful like vibrant orange color and i hate when i can't open and the packaging like tears from the side so this is the packaging really nice packaging not too plastic but i mean it's nice and you have the details here and you have the branding here it's like the cream to powder form uh and it, you can see it is like so so vibrant so feels nice so i'm gonna swatch it beside the tower 28 balm okay after blending it it is like powder it looks actually pretty so we'll see how it looks on my face and second i have the shade primer donor which is like a neon pink vibrant pink color so we have the same packaging details behind and then you have this beautiful pink color i mean this is like neon pink i need to be careful they are like super pigmented so i don't think you would need like a lot so i'll see how it goes and how it works because they seem and they look pretty 
deep pigmented so these are these watches then from tart cosmetics i got all the new things and they are coming out with new things again and again and i don't want to like order every time so anyways i got this i don't know who was packaging my order but they were really kind enough to give me the brush set free i haven't paid anything for this but i don't know why i got this brush free and they are like super good quality i mean it's like nice and heavy and good not too heavy but it's like nice good quality so i'm excited to try this i'll first wash it and then start using then start using and whoever packed my order thank you so much for the brush that it was i'm like glad and uh, let's go into these things so firstly i got the tart c glow light skin filter so this is very similar to the charlotte tilbury uh flawless filter and i got the shade glimmer which is the champagne color so we have the packaging nice and big bottle not too small not too like bulky as you know i've already done review on these so it's already up i tried all the blushes the contour and this so yeah it's amazing but this has like a lot of coverage you can use it on its own and i got from tart website because these are not yet available here even after their trip to dubai i don't know why it's not yet available here so next we have the tart manita blush and glow cheek plump and i got the shade coral this also packaging is very similar to the uh, skin filter and i got this nice corally color i don't think this is pretty new but uh, i want to try this out nice corally color and this is also like very shimmery glowy kind feels like a lip gloss actually nice and pretty then next going on to the tart sculpt tape and i got the shade cool bronze packaging is very similar to the charlotte tilbury one and you have the sculpt tape written all over similar packaging you have to twist it on like squeeze it and then you have the product so this is the contour uh, it's a nice color and it was super comfortable and super easy to use which i appreciate and it has like all i think six or seven shades as compared to the charlotte tilbury one so that is good this is also not too expensive so i like that then i have all the three blushes so these are the blush shape liquid blush from tarte and i got the shade peach pink and berry so this is the shade peach which looks much more bronzier rather than peachy and then we have the shade pink which is like a nice baby pink color and we have the shade berry which could have been much more deeper the packaging very same i'm just going to quickly swatch for you guys and these are like the glowier one so these are the three swatches this is the shade peach this is the shade pink and this is the shade berry as you can see pink is like way too light peachy doesn't look like really peachy the berry is like much more pinkier and it is like super glowy so you have like very very glowy products but i wish they come out with new colors for like deeper skin tone and variation more variations in these uh, blushes i know they might be like flattering but i don't think they are like flattering on every skin tone so that is all that i got from tart now going on to cult beauty i got few things because i usually buy products from there because yeah sometimes i get like discount so firstly we have the new charlotte tilbury blushes so these are the matte beauty blush wand and i got three shades the fourth shade that is the pillow talk one that is i think available in store not online and now this is also available here in dubai in uae in their store so i think the fourth shade might be available there because i haven't like gone to the store and seen if they have like the fourth one so these are the three colors tang and mocha they both are like giving me looks whenever i drop something because they are like sleeping so they are like anyways i got all the three shades we have the pink pop peach pop and dream pop i think charlotte tilbury was coming out first with these things i mean they was i think they came out first no doubt but they had teased i'm not saying uh brands copy each other they might be like inspired by each other but anyway the tart pa packaging is also like very similar so these are the three colors i mean packaging wise no doubt the tart one is beautiful on its own but uh, the these are like matte blushes so they have like this soft touch and they look very beautiful so if you have like a beautiful vanity if you want to display it these look very pretty seriously they look so pretty and so i'm quickly just going to swatch it so these are the three colors this is the pink one this is the peach one and this is the dream pop so the pink one is way too light actually i haven't yet tried it i have to try then the peach one is like much is like nice and peachy 
and the dream pop is also very pretty so i don't know how this would look on like my skin tone because it's way too light so let's see how it works and it is like a matte formula and charlotte tilbury products are like so expensive but i don't know i feel like i need to have all the products in my collection because they look so beautiful on your skin seriously they look very pretty then going then on to the next thing i got the say beauty liquid cheek flush i have two shades already but i got, saw like the new shade which is in the shade poppy i thought i'll grab this and i got like 20 percent off on this there was like some discount or sale going on very beautiful corally color i don't know why this is like there's like pink pigment on this but this is like a very pretty oh my god you can't even see. this is like a nice pink color not pink actually it is like a nice vibrant coral color which i'm excited to try then we have the say beauty hydra beam sheer brightening under eye concealer i got the shade three and a half and this is like way dark for me i don't know i matched i think myself wrong but this is way too deep this might be like good for my entire face but not for my un under eyes i need like something like a bit brightening rather than this this is too deep i need like much more lighter shade so maybe next whenever i order i might buy like a you can see like how deep it is deep of deep for my skin tone actually i need like much more lighter shade than this so i'll see whenever i am able to buy then we have the say beauty slip Tint, tinted moisturizer and i got the shade three and a half i hope even this is not like too dark for me so this is the packaging really nice squeezy tube with a pump which i appreciate this is like i think dewy form try to face generously with fingers i think this is like the dewy one i think so i'm not sure so these products are also really good i love safe products i am glad that the uh, indie brands are coming out with really good products then i got the kosas revealer super premium brightening concealer and i got the shade 3.0 light with neutral olive undertones this color is like good it's nice and brightening so i got this color the packaging is very pretty you can see this is like nice and brightening the say one is like way too deep so i don't know what happened there but i'll see like a different color then from say beauty again i got the air set radiant loose setting powder in the shade translucent i don't know what happened here i actually was supposed to buy the coarsest concealer coarsest powder and because the coarsest powder was also available in like different colors which i wanted and i added that to the cart and when i ordered but i don't know what happened uh but i got two of these one is there in my uh other drawers so i got two of these so i don't know what happened maybe they didn't have it and they sent me these two because i checked the invoice also and uh, somehow i got ordered these this two pieces which i didn't so i don't know what happened there but i didn't contact cult beauty because i don't know whether they would be replacing it or not i'm not even sure so i don't know what happened maybe it was my mistake or mistake from their side i'm not sure but i'm pretty sure i added the coarsest powder and not two pieces of this anyways we have the say beauty air set radiant loose setting powder in translucent so this is the packaging very similar to their bronzer and i got the shade translucent this doesn't have a lot of just has four grams usually the huda beauty one has 20 grams and i'm very sure even the laura mercier one has but uh, maybe it's like a indie brand maybe that's why i'm not sure not a lot of product but this was all not like too expensive but i think there should be like more product in this four grams is like nothing for a powder so you have the nice twist up packaging so let's see whenever we'll try these out and now i have two if it's good then good if it's not good what i'm gonna do with the other one then next the we next have the charlotte tilbury hollywood glow glide face architect highlighter and i got the shade champagne glow i wanted the pink pop as well but it's like expensive so i want to see first how it looks on my face and how the formula is and then maybe later on later on in the year i might buy because this is also available on namshi carry charlotte tilbury products but the highlighters are available and the champagne pop champagne glow the champagne glow one is not available others or other all the shades are available so why they do that i'm not really sure whether they don't have the or they prefer to keep it uh, in store i don't know for everything even like the makeup by mario lip bar, lip liners only three shades are here available in dubai even in store online i mean there are like maybe 20 shades he has like 20 shades but only three are available glow lip that is only available in seven shades i don't know why they don't release like every shade here so anyways we have 
the highlighter and the pan actually moves and i'm gonna just put this slightly it's like nice and champagne -y. but i think i might buy the pink one as well later on anyways it's nice and glowy i didn't actually want any more highlighter i'll do a full face of charlotte tilbury soon i think i have like everything now so yeah i can try this out as well so i think with that we are actually done with our entire haul okay i have like one more thing i forgot so i i mean i'm not gonna use this seriously i'm not gonna but i wanted this in my collection and i was actually waiting this from so long they were like not available on the website i think it's like a limited edition one so they were just in stock so i got this and i used my points i just paid for the shipping uh charges around like 22 to 23 dirham so i got this like almost not free but for like 23 or 22 dirhams 23 dirhams i think so we have two mini these are like mini puffs but honestly i'm not going to use these so first we have this pink heart shaped puff and you can use it for your under eyes but honestly i'm just going to keep it in my collection and then you have this smaller one and you get two of each uh, so it's like good price here we are with all the products so with that we are actually done with the haul video please do let me know in the comment section which products you want me to try out first i have already tried the dart products anyways guys if you like this video please give a thumbs up and please do subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell so yeah guys i'll see you soon in the next video bye